All right, everyone. I already made a video showing how to use TeamViewer for remote tech support. You can link your computer to another one and actually see their screen and help them with any problems they might have on their computer and vice versa. They can do the same for you. If you, It just depends on how you connect. Well, this time I'm going to show you how you can use TeamViewer for large file sharing. Now normally it would be for remote control to see their monitor and their screen and their computer to do repairs. This time I'm going to put it on file transfer and that is the other person's ID number already. I already have it in there and I already know the password number which is 9859. Five, nine. And by the way it's random. They pick one out every time you open it for privacy reasons and right here I already know right where to go and then click on cam studio it's one that I recorded let's see now Gmail for one only allows 20 megabytes the largest file you can send so I'm gonna do this in here 83 megabytes click to highlight it click on send simple as that now it's being sent now it will take a while so I'm gonna pause this video and I will be right back alright I'm back now, as you can see here this shows the file size was 83.24 megabytes and it counts down and by the way this this whole file sending here to send that size it took pretty close to 10 minutes and it counts down it tells you how far and how many kilobytes per second up here and when it gets to the end it will actually be transferred from my file right here to this file right here to the other computer you got four three okay there's the video that I went the 83.24 megabytes right there on her computer now you can do the same thing on on, on receiving I can take a, a file or a picture from that computer and click receive and it'll get sent to mine it's really a cool deal now when you're done you can close that and close all of this and cancel and then change it to remote and since the ID number is still the same I can click connect and the password number is still in there I can click log in and there is the, com the monitor and the screen and the computer the whole bit from where I just sent it to that computer it takes a couple clicks to get this set off of there alright now there it is there's her files the whole team viewer file transfer e event log and everything. Now I can close that. I can go into her pictures and I can drag it off onto the screen if I wanted to be the cheap easy way or you can right click on it and create a, sh a desktop shortcut which is what I did here. Now here's a, a video it was a smaller one just to try it out and it created a desktop icon. It's really a cool deal. I mean there is like I said Gmail only allows 20 megabytes and nothing bigger there's only a couple other sites that you could go to to send files for free but even those only allow five files per month I mean that's that's one of them drop send is one of them by the way but this here is unlimited size any amount all day every day you can send files it's really a cool deal. Alright you guys, thank you very much for watching.